Today I'm offering you to have a look at a couple more fascinating Telegram life hacks. My personal favorite is number 5, so be sure to watch this video till the end and give it a thumbs up. And also let me know in the comments if you knew about any of them. Time to get started. The first tip is message notifications without a preview. If you don't want someone to see what you're discussing in your messenger or you have some privacy concerns, you just have to disable message previews. It's easy to do. Go to Settings, Notifications and Sounds, find Message Notifications, select Private Chats and turn off Message Preview. Now, every time you get a text, the preview will only say New Message. The following life hack may be useful for channel admins or just for those who want to make their communication in Telegram more fascinating. You can embed a link in a certain word when texting someone in the messenger. On iOS you should do the following. Write a word, tap it twice, and you'll get a submenu. Find Edit, tap on it, and find the word Link. Click on it, and Telegram will prompt you to add a link for the word you selected. In Android, you gotta do pretty much the same thing. Write the word, highlight it, tap on the three dots at the top right corner and select Create Link. Then the messenger will also offer to insert the link that you want. This, by the way, leads us to another life hack – text modification. You may have noticed that both on Android and iOS, the user can make the text bold, italic or strike out. All the steps are just the same as I mentioned above, but instead of the link, choose another option that you need. Next tip is about photos. Now, when sending a picture, the user has 48 hours to change the photo which has already been sent. How to do it? Long tap on the message with the photo that was sent. Then select Edit. On the left you can see a paper clip with an arrow. It means that the user has the opportunity to change the photo that was sent earlier. At the same time, the picture will have the edited label. So if you want to send something important and then replace it, and you think the user won't notice, just know that they will. On Android, it's a little different. You send the photo you want, long tap on it, and then select the pencil at the top, which will take you to change the media file. Tap on Replace Media and choose another picture. And I'll continue in just a moment, but first I'm gonna ask you to subscribe to the channel. And you won't regret it, because I believe our awesome community should grow and interact even more. So join us if you haven't done it yet, and we're moving on. Next up is tip number 5. If you wish to set a special sound for a certain user or chatroom, Telegram provides such an opportunity to go to Settings notifications and sounds, and then select, for example, exceptions in message notifications. Next, add a specific person and you can select a different sound for them. You can do the same for channels as well as for chats. Next is a useful tip for those who have chats. Here's the gist of it. Telegram allows you to find a message from a certain person in the chat. To do this, go to the chat that you need, select search and then tap on the human icon at the bottom of the screen. Now Messenger will offer you a list of people who are in the chat. Choose any of them. And firstly, you can see all the messages from this user. Secondly, you can enter a specific word and find this word in the chat. Number 7 is web video messaging. Bear with me, I'm gonna explain what it is in a second. We all know how to send video messages in Telegram, but few of us know that some of them can have real web links, which means you can share this video link with people that can watch it even in their browser. But here's the thing, you can only get a link to such a video only if you take it from a public Telegram channel, then it will work in any browser. Send a video in a public channel, tap on the arrow next to it and select copy link. As a result, the messenger will give you the link that everyone will be able to open in Telegram and in their browser. And last but not least, here's another little tip for channel posts. If you want to send someone a link to a particular post, just tap on the arrow next to it and choose copy the link. Once you've got it, it will take the other users straight to the post you just sent them. And that's all I have with the life hacks for today. Let me know in the comments which one you liked the best, which you didn't know about, 
and you found out about today in my video. Better yet, share in the comments the life hacks and tips and telegram that you know. I'm looking forward to your comments. And that's all I have. Thanks for watching. It's the Telebloke channel. Subscribe and be trendy.